So now let's have a look at the solo. First of all, let's look at the uh, basic harmonic pattern, the harmonic uh, progression, chord progression. <coughs> it's D major, F major, A minor, G major. And the good thing is, it doesn't change over the solo. And what happens in the right hand is basically just in the uh, D minor blues scale. But very interesting licks. Let's have a look at the first one. The second lick starts with an upbeat. As I said, uh, the upbeat is important, and then you have uh, quarter triplets. And you nearly have to feel that you le lose the rhythm, that you don't know where you are in the uh, rhythm anymore, but then it's important that you are back on the on the beat uh, on the fourth uh, bass note. Uh, that's important. Good. Now comes my favorite part. Beginning is easy. Again on the upbeat. I'm not quite sure. I think uh, original he has an octave here. Here. But as I like to have my third finger here, I don't play this octave. In order to have this lick, this melody running, um, uh, and I'm quite sure he, he skips the C. I mean the A. That's easy. Uh, here, uh, uh, feel the triplets again. Yeah, this last lick you could. Um, also, separate this lick again in uh, a few, I think three or four little licks. And they're also again uh, connected with upbeats. Mm -hmm. 